BJP's campaign. Now, during his visit, Prime Minister Modi will lay the foundation stones of several projects worth Rs 13,500 crore. Now, he will also address public rallies in Mahabubnagar district. Now, with Karnataka gone, BJP is trying to give its best in Telangana in order to keep its house in, in uh, Telangana and to garner more votes in the upcoming polls. Now, it recently made two major changes in the state by appointing Union Minister G. Kishan Reddy as the state chief and also appointed MLA Etela Rajander as Election Management Committee. Now, meanwhile, ahead of PM's visit, BRS has hit out at the BJP saying this, that the Saffron Party has not done anything for the state and that the people of Telangana will vote to BRS to power for the third time as well. Being in the government, BJP has not done anything to the state of Telangana. They have not honoured a single promise which was made during the formation of Telangana state. And our request to accord the national status to one of our irrigation projects also was not you know, heard of. And despite the Niti Aayog recommendation, the BJP government has not given any financial assistance to our flagship initiatives like Mission Bhagiradha and you know, Mission Kakatiya. And now exactly before the elections, if you visit our state, you know, show a drama that you are going to uh, lay the foundations and inaugurating many development programs, do you think that people of Telangana will believe that? Our people are intelligent. They understand BJP's true colors. You come for a dozen more times. Telangana is not going to believe BJP. And they already have made up their mind to elect Honorable KCR Garu as their chief minister for third time. Meanwhile, the Bharatiya Janta Party's poll panel will hold a key meet today. At the meeting, the BJP is likely to make key decisions pertaining to the upcoming assembly elections in five states. Prime Minister Narendra Modi, Home Minister Amit Shah and several other union ministers beside party's chief JP Nadda are among the members of the Apex Committee. Now, in the last two meetings, the panel gathered and deliberated upon the names of the candidates for Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh assembly polls. With that